Hello everyone, welcome back to Gidroid Tips and in this video we are going to talk about how to fix Red Dead Redemption 2 Online is having out of memory error. You can try this for both Red Dead Redemption 2 and how we can fix this error. So let's dive into the workaround. The first one when you are having this trouble, all we have to do is we just need to make sure the game is up to date. So right now the game is up to date, it is fine with it. But most cases this would not be the same. So you have to cross check whether you made this particular settings. For this just go over here in the game, right click and go to the properties. Now go to the updates. Over here as you can see there are option that is always keep this game updated. Only keep this game when I launch it or update it. High priority to set this game before. So keep this to always keep this game updated and you can try launching the game. And most probably this will be making the game up to date so that you will not be having this trouble. So it is very vital important that you have to keep the game updated. Next one is all about we have to update the driver that is GPU drivers. For this we just need to go over here in the start. Right click over here and we have to go to the task manager. Now from here what we need to do is once you go over here we just need to right click. Go over here into device manager. Now from here we just need to go over here, go to the display adapters, make sure that you update the graphics card as well as we can also make sure that you have also updated apparently the audio drivers can also be updated. So you just need to update the driver. Once you update the driver we just need to close this, we just need to go back and we just need to try launch the game. Next one is all about nothing but we have to increase the virtual memory. For this reason we have to go over here, we need to search for view advanced system setting first, go to the advanced tab. Go to the settings once again, go to the advanced once again, go for change. So make sure the local disk C is selected, go to the custom size, set the value for initial size that is 1.5 times rotal RAM and the maximum size is should be 3 times rotal RAM. So we need a calculator first, so I have to do a calculation. So 32 GB is the RAM, so I just need to type my RAM, multiply it with a constant value 1024, that brings me 32768. So we have to copy this and we have to paste it. Next one we have to go for the maximum size that is 32 GB multiplied with 1024 that brings you into 3 that brings you 98304. So we just need to copy this as well as we need to paste this as well. Once you set this the value we just need to close everything and we just need to try launching the game because increasing the virtual memory worker for many users we can try this out. Next one is all about we need to update the windows so just go over here in the search Go to the settings over here, go to the windows update, just update your windows and make sure that you are up to date. It is very important that when you are running these kind of games, they should be up to date. Once afterwards still you are having the issue, we can try with the next one that is performing a clean boot. So just go over here in the search, we have to go to system configuration, go to services, go for disable old, go for hide all Microsoft services, not this, go for disable old, go for hide all Microsoft services, go for apply and go for ok and go for restart. So I'm going to go for exit without restart, the users has to go for restart. Once you restart the game, try launching the game. Next one is all about we need to verify integrity of game file. So just go over here, right click and we have to go to the properties, go to the installed file and just click on the verify integrity of game file. So uh, what you need to do is going to get, take a little bit of time because the game is around 120 GB so it's going to take time. We still cross check every single files of a game and if any files are corrupted and if any files are missing and all these kind of issues will be fixed by this particular one. So these are the possible workaround which can be done when you are having an issue with Red Dead Redemption 2 memory out of error or out of memory error which is happening for many of the users and how you can fix this up. I hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.